Hello YouTubers, this is Big Boss Jim coming from the model shop. I wanted to show you some things I'm doing. And did I mention I hate this kit? I'm going to change the name of it from Casper to Casper's Revenge because it's just fitting. Okay, you see I don't have the bumper on it. I didn't like this front bumper the way it turned out with a chrome bumper on the rear and that on the front. So I'm painting the bumpers the body color. I haven't put the front bumper on yet because I got to sand it out some more. It's got some spots in it. But I'll show you some of the other stuff I did. I took the grill and I sanded the back side of it down quite a bit. Uh, as you can see it's recessed back in now the way it should be okay I've got the hood looking better alright uh, in order to do that I sanded the sides down on it to give me a little more even gap I took off the back side of it here of the hood and I cut off the uh, way they had it hinged because it just it wasn't right it's still not right but it's a lot better okay now I can open the hood somewhat I put my own hinge system in it uh, it works fairly well I can take the hood off if I want to but uh, that's the that's the way it is right now okay and of course I had to repaint the hood and everything so that's where I'm at on that let me turn the back around and show you what I did back here. I took all the moldings off the back side of it. And uh, one of the main reasons I did that, I was trying to fix those dimples that you remember were in the, were in the thing. Okay. Uh, so my old clumsy hands, I got sanding into the molding so I decided I was just going to take them off and uh, just give it a smooth back end on it. Now if you can see right here I made hinges for it. If you see right here I made hinges very similar to what the plastic ones was except these are metal. It's made out of the uh, you find it at Walmart the wire that they use for jewelry and stuff like that. Okay. Uh, it won't open all the way. It probably would, but I'm afraid to force it because it's still got the little plastic hinges on that gate, and I, I don't want to break those. Uh, I got the rear bumper on. It gave me a fit. I had to reconstruct. I had to remake things for it. Uh, I'm probably going to have to clear coat the back end again because it's my clumsy hands. I may even have to redo the tailgate because I got glue on it. I don't know if it'll sand off before it starts sanding through into the paint. But I got it looking better in that way. Uh, as you see, I can hinge it. It won't. It won't come all the way, but it's. I'm, I'm afraid to force it. And. Uh, but that's that's the way it's looking as of right now. I gotta redo my speakers because I jerked the face off of them. Uh, I tried to get the bumper to set level again. I had it fairly level with the chrome but uh, I don't know for some reason or other it just damn didn't want to fit. Like I said I hate this kit. But it, it does look somewhat better so I'm still trying to straighten things out on it uh, I've looked for other 55 kits because I really would like to get one and get it right uh, I'm afraid to buy another ATM kit because it would probably be just as bad because I'm not the only one that said that this was a bad kit nothing fit nothing worked things broke so anyhow, that's where I'm at on it. Uh, still working on it. Still trying to get it 
decent. It's not going to be showroom, no. But I would like to get it better. I still hadn't sand and buffed it. I'll probably have a problem with that the way it's, it's been treating me. Oh, Casper's Revenge. Uh, so I'll have to wait and see on that. I hope I don't have any problems with it. Anyway, there will be a short uh, slideshow uh, after I'm done blabbing here. It won't be much. It'll show you some of the details I did like on the interior and the bed and and uh, some of the other stuff before I, I, I redid this. But I did want to show you guys that I, I did manage to make hinges. They work fairly decent. Like I say, I'm afraid to force it all the way open because I don't want to break those little plastic hinges on the tailgate itself. But that's where it's at. Uh, I should have my 56. It may be here tomorrow. I went up on Ravel's uh, forum or webpage and was looking at the models there. And uh, I'll even post a picture of the one that I've got coming. But they, you could download the, uh, the instruction sheet. And I downloaded the instruction sheets for the 56. And it's, it's totally different from this kit. It appears that the way they're doing it, the way they're hinging the hood, the way they're doing this, the way they're doing that, is, is the correct way. It's the way that I would logically think that it should be. Uh, I'm probably not going to do any drastic thing like cut the roof off on it or not. I'll probably build it pretty close to box stock. Uh, it's a two-in-one kit so I can do other little things you know and keep it basically original and uh, I, I'm almost positive it'll be a much better kit I've searched for other 65 or I'm sorry 55 nomads but uh, the only ones I can find are the ATMs and I just don't feel like doing it so anyway stay tuned for the slideshow it, it'll be a short one and uh, thanks a lot guys you got any comments or advices or anything for me I'd surely appreciate it I really would uh, so this is Big Boss Jim signing off from the model shop and uh, you guys have a nice time building your models and I hope you don't have the luck that I'm having with this one. Uh, oh, I might mention too, I did look at the, uh, see how the paint was coming along or coming off of my uh, 50 truck. Pretty good. I've got the cab in one type of solution and i got the uh, fenders and the bed and the setter in the other. Uh, I've got it in the purple power. And it's doing actually a better job than what I got the cab in. So probably when I get the uh, uh, bed and fenders and that out of the uh, purple power, it's almost all off. Uh, I'll probably have to take the cab out of the one solution and put it in the purple power. So, all right. See you later, guys. Be good, be careful, and bye-bye.